Right now at 10, a woman murdered inside her Southside apartment, and now a man is behind bars charged in the crime. This is a story that we've been tracking since police first told us they were looking into a violent crime Friday. And tonight, JSO's transparency website shows 25-year-old Marcus Fishburne is charged with second-degree murder, evidence tampering, and possession of a weapon by a convicted felon. But we don't yet know the name of the victim. News 4 Jack reporter Corley Peel is joining us outside the apartment complex. And Corley, you spoke with Fishburne's father. I did, and this is not the first time Marcus Fishburne has been in jail. Records show that he was recently arrested for domestic battery on December 12th, and his father tells me that that involved him. He says he didn't want to press charges. He just wanted his son to get help because he had been struggling with certain issues, including drugs, and he says he never thought his son would ever be accused of a violent murder. A sign on the front door saying enter if you dare and an evidence marker is where police say a young woman was killed Friday. JSO records showed 25 year old Marcus Fishburne is charged in her murder. His father Kent Fishburne tells me he spoke with his son that morning. I talked to him and he seemed fine. He didn't seem like you know somebody who just got through doing something crazy like that. Investigators say the woman's boyfriend came home to find their apartment at Green Tree Place covered in blood. After he called 911, detectives found the woman's body and they believe she was killed during a struggle. There were just like a bunch of police just in this little courtyard, you know, do not cross line everywhere and it was for hours. JSO says police took Fishburne into custody that day. They say he had been living with the couple. Fishburne's father tells News for Jacks all three of them were good friends. Yeah, they used to come and pick him up all the time, spend the weekend at the house and everything. So, you know, like I say, I didn't have no idea that was anything going on. It just, a lot of it don't make sense to me. Do you feel he's innocent? Some part of me does, but I don't want to, you know, be like thinking that, you know, just because he's my son, they say he's innocent. You know what I'm saying? I want to, uh, hopefully everything comes out that it, that it is. Despite police saying the evidence points to Fishburne, his father is hoping it's not him. Police are not releasing the name of the woman who was killed at this time. I did speak with neighbors who say that they would always see her in passing. They say she was always nice and friendly and their hearts go out to her family. Marcus Fishburne is being held in Duval County Jail without bond. Reporting live from the South Side, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.